Okay, mic is on for once. Don't know how sound is. Hope someone tells me. I guess it'd be smart to put this on my Twitter thread. Nobody's watching. Also, hello, YouTube. If I put this one on YouTube, I don't think I did with the last one. Well, let's fucking go. There's going to be a lot of quick saving. Just so you know. No sense for how much of a unit a decibel is. How's that? awkward part about using the Doom 1 bestiary, which has like seven monsters in it, um, is that half of them are hit scanners, which is not great. Where is my thing? That's very... Maybe I should turn auto run off because this is a little ridiculous. A little lower? Okay. Do I have a run key? Oh my god. I don't know. Action? Is run. Oh, mouse four. Okay, yeah, perfect. Let's see here. How do I get in there? Um, 
can I hop on that other secret? sure how this is useful, but alright. Oh, maybe I can like skip stuff. items. There are secrets left. Okay. Hmm. Oh, that's pretty good. Oh, that's pretty bad. So I do not have a caps lock key, so I cannot use caps for top and run. Okay, that's all the secrets. Still stuff to kill. Uh, maybe we will use top and run now. to get 100%, or it doesn't count. Why is that little hole there? Oh, maybe there's just a critter in it, I guess. Oh, fucking hell. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna try and not save scum, but also, I hear this is intense, so I might have to save scum. Uh, in fact, what, I, what I've heard about this on UV is that John Romero will make me his bitch. Oh, wait. Okay, that's kind of annoying. Get your attention from here. I saw your horn a little bit. Okay. Now we've done 100. Cool. That wasn't so bad. I only had to quick load 17 times. Doesn't this one have a cyber demon in it? Whatever. 
jump down there. Oh, and I don't have any bullets. Um, we'll save that for later. I remember nothing about any of these maps. I just sort of ran through them. They were kind of surprisingly linear for Romero maps. Oh, uh, there's that guy. Uh, which I guess is kind of still the case, although the secrets are helping so far. Whoa! Fuck. Also, very cramped. That sounded like a side of demon. It is. Okay. No problem. Well, there's a little bit of a problem. Okay. Plan A was to have an infight with that sergeant, and I don't think that's gonna work. Plan B is that. <laughs> I cannot believe that worked. Okay, I do appreciate Puzzle Boss. Still no bullets. Do I have to kill a fucking Baron with a shotgun? That's like 15 shells. I guess it's not too bad. Okay, it's more than 15. There we go. Now that looks... Hmm. That looks like some fire blue. Excellent. Set the title. Um, I I don't really know what the setting of this is. There's a lot of cracks. That one's a star, which feels like it means it could be a teleporter, but it isn't. Well, let's just run around a bit. Do these lead somewhere? They do not. Alright. Well, I have a key. Is there a door? I do really like, um... Oh, uh, did I waste that? No, I didn't. Uh, in the first map, that first secret led into a second secret. I am a huge sucker for that kind of thing. I love double secrets. I do wish Romero would make a Doom 2 map. Because um, there's more stuff in Doom 2 than in Doom 1. That looks like I should shoot it. Okay. Well, that didn't do anything. so bizarre, the progression in these, like, I'm just walking this tiny catwalk around where I started. And there's a lot of revisiting, but it still feels very constrained, and there's only one way to go forward at any given time. Also, I wonder if I can turn off items, because I don't care. I can't. 
Okay, I keep misreading that as secrets, which I don't want to do. Um, oh, hang on. I think I saw an unpegged texture in there, John. We're on a first name basis, me and John. Oh, good. That was a lot of teleports happening all at the same time. Oh, this is great. I don't remember how much health Kakadins have. Too much. Oh, less than I thought. Okay, so far this is not quite as bad as people made it out to be. And of course, now that I've said that, I will immediately regret it. But like, I'm doing better now than I was when I played this on Hurt Me Plenty. I fucking knew it. Hmm. Armor? This is suspicious as hell, dude. Oh my god, fuck off. I'm rooting for the... Oh. Cacodemon. Well, uh, need some gun. It feels like a map that was meticu hmm. meticulously designed to take exactly a specific amount of ammo, and that's how much I get. That looks like something. It was not. I can't believe I fell for this twice. I didn't die, so I guess we can... Look in lava some more, just in case. This is a poor use of blue armor. Um. Wait, I've only found one secret. But all the kills. Well. Now comes the very boring part of the stream. Um where I stare at the map for a while. Well, there is a very big, not explored area in the middle there. Which is, I guess, behind this wall. Did that go up? No, no, so it's like that. just a fluke. I just felt like hitting that wall. I'm really good at this. Also, I'm not sure how the Berserk was a secret, but I'll take it. Um, that leaves... Oh, that Berserk is not even on the map at all. That's mean. Uh, what does that leave? Not sure. I do like stuff that activates when you walk up to it, too. And that's... I don't know. Not very doomy, because I also like pressing switches a lot, but... Um... It has a different feel to it, I guess. Oh, unexplored biz on the other side. Is it actually unexplored, or is it just that? It's just that. That's just all marked not on map. Okay. Well, he's pretty good at telegraphing if you pay attention. So what am I not paying attention to? 
why is this all not on map except a couple bits and pieces? That's weird. Um, I'm open to suggestions. There's like no regular health in these, but oh. Um how do I get you? It looks like there's stuff off to the left. I need a lift or something. Wait, oh wait, is that one I saw earlier but didn't pick up? But this... Oh, there was a secret. Did I... Did I die and load to before I picked this up? Okay, well... And I didn't actually miss anything. Whoops. My bad. Okay. That's two done. Okay, I keep trying to press shift for use, so this, this binding is not working out great. What the hell is use? Um, I don't have any more keys. How about R for toggle run? That seems very sensible. Uh, you have to flag, if you flag lines as secret, um, the, the naming is a bit weird. If you flag lines as secret, uh, then they show on the auto map like they were one-sided walls. You can also flag them as not on map and then they will never show. And that's completely unrelated to whether it is actually a secret sector. It's just called the same thing because it's a useful thing to put on a door that opens into a secret. All right. This doesn't look familiar at all. Wait, is there a secret level in this? Well, the secret exit would be in a secret, so if I'm going for all secrets. I will probably stumble upon it. Hey, buddy. Oh, wait, okay, this, ow. Ah, oh, my 200. This window looks familiar. Does this whole thing open up? Maybe that's what happens. Also, honestly, it's pretty impressive how much he did um, with just the line specials that were in Doom 1. That's so weird. Now my question is, were these all lowered before I turned the corner? Probably. There are a lot of cat demons. Oh, I'm full on bullets. Awesome. One thing I do really like about Doom 1 is that the chain gun is actually like pretty fucking solid. Well, yeah, I think I've heard something. Like, he's faking multiple actions with one switch because he both did a door open and lowered the thing out of view um, and I assume that's because bullet triggers can be on two sides of the lines but I have heard that it is possible to soft lock if you happen to shoot uh, such that a bullet crosses one line but not the other and that's a shame so we'll try not to do that. Does this hurt me? New and John. Oh, it totally does. Okay. 
We got a bucket. And it's real hard to see in the dark. And green walls with green suit. Exactly how many I need. This is also pretty good at recreating the Doom experience of every time a door opens. I wish it hadn't. Come on, imps. Haha, <laughs> suckers. I guess I did not make particularly effective use of this radiation suit. That's fine. When do I get a plasma gun? so much better than my first try on Herbie Planet. And I remember nothing. Okay, well, still getting hit in the side of my dumb head. But okay, who's doing that? I do like the effect of bright daylight outside and the imps are in uh, completely black cages. That's all you see are their silhouettes. Also, it's interesting to put a wall on those so you can't kill them from here. Also, I thought I was good on ammo, and then suddenly I'm very not again. I feel like a bunch of stuff is going to open as I progress along this walkway. Oh, a bunch of stuff happened. Okay, one thing happened, and I don't know what it was exactly. Oh, did the cacodemon step on a teleporter? That's pretty funny. I hear a man. That looks like a secret. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, well, I don't know. The super shotgun, they probably could have stood to rebalance some of the enemies and mostly the chain gun. Like, super shotgun being equivalent to rocket launcher, I think kind of works because the rocket launcher is really bad at, at close up, but the super shotgun is really good close up, so it's fine. And the plasma gun's still useful. Everything's still useful except the chain gun. Because, really? I can just barely not make that? I'm still running, right? Yeah. Um. Oh, we're gonna need to SR40 this. Would he design a map you'd need to SR40? Really bad at this. Uh, yeah, it's mostly just the chain gun. Because it was useful for crowd control, and then. And then the uh, super shotgun kind of took that over. I'm I don't usually strafe run, so I have no idea how to do it with like aiming for somewhere. Crap. Oh, this sucks. <laughs> what if I jump? <laughs> oh, it's a Z Doom set, so he disabled jumping. I guess I'll just have to learn to strafe run right now, live. It's fine. It's fine. We'll get this. There we go. Cool. Excellent. I like this twitching body to mark sort of the end of where I'm allowed to go. Ooh. A 
double secret. Oh, I love it. I'm gonna save that. Actually, maybe not, because it seems like it'll be hard to get back here. Well, I guess we'll see what happens. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I mean, this uses a bunch of Z-Doom features, so I'm very sure it was um, also tried with... Well, like, it, the map disables jumping, which is very polite. Um, and I'm sure it is intended to work if you're using mouse slip, too. Oh, this seems like I'll regret it. Oh, a door opened. Oh, it's just a shark. Oh, come on. Oh, I got a backpack. Hell yeah. Like I'm ever going to have enough ammo to need a backpack. Oh, this sucks. Oh, I would love if these lost souls would stop getting caught on geometry and come help me out a little bit. Whoops, it is. Oh, that's fine. I feel like I played through this the first time without even having a chain gun. I can't be right, but. It seems to be making things a lot nicer. Oh. Why is that wall... Oh, is that where the Baron came from? Okay. Pain chance. Yes. What? Oh, fuck off. Oh my god. Okay, this is a pretty precarious place to be fighting a bunch of cacodemons. Alright. Alright, we're almost there. I guess I'll go grab that health. Oh my god, is it even worth it? There's still two secrets somewhere. Okay. I do like I do like linking back. It like it still feels linear, like I'm being very much nudged down a path. There's not so much exploration except for finding secrets, but it it the map does end up being very Romero loopy. It's just weird that it doesn't start that way. It just has to reveal itself doing that. Um well, the one secret is again not even on the map. I'm almost at the end and I don't know where more stuff is. I would like to have a look in here again. Oh, of course that hurts. A lot. Fuck you, John. Ugh. Anything down here? Does not look like it. I'm not sure if this is a one-way trip or not. Wait, oh, I think I found this one by myself before. Except it's not a secret. Come on, come on. There we go. Oh, ho, ho, ho. very nice. Oh, someday, I hope the Cacodemon wins. It's super weird they have the same, like, pain grunt 
Oh yeah, I actually saw a video that was like lauding how all the monsters make different noises in Doom, and then complained that like the Cacodemon Demon, Lost Soul, and Baron all just have the same. Uh, so you can't tell which one you hit just by listening. But I guess that's kind of a shame. Okay, all kills. One secret remains somewhere. Somewhere. Well, that's a platform. Don't know if that means anything. What if this teleporter is a secret to it's not? What if this teleporter it's not either? Hmm. Nothing over there. He has been really good about giving me peeks secrets. Is there like one teleporter pad with a different texture or something? It's the kind of stupid crap I would do, thinking, yeah, everybody would notice this. Nobody does, and then also I don't either. Okay, that one has a different texture. And that means nothing. Hmm. Don't really want to wall hump. Okay, that's where I was from over there. Um, this map is not very big. Is there like a texture? Yep, that one had the bar along the bottom. Oh, well, thanks for the auto map, I guess. Oh, do I have to go back through the lava to get over there? I guess I'll pick up the green armor. Hundred, hundred. So, I I feel like there is a secret level. Does anyone know where the exit is? We're on four now, and this is like the latest map I would expect there to be a secret level exit in. Oh yeah. I only learned that recently. Lost souls get stuck if they hit items. Like that stops their charge. Did not expect that. Five secrets this time. I love these beams. I love the like partial shadow of the cast. I saw a, uh, oh, okay, the floor is breaking behind me. Okay, there's a wall now. What? Oh, oh, I have rockets. Oh, let's use some of those. But I saw a review of Sigil from a, a YouTube person. Ah. And, uh, it's just like moving randomly or is it triggered by like the Baron walking around or is it this light? Okay. Uh, anyway, and this person was complaining that Sigil is this terrible garbage because it doesn't even use any, any Doom 2 enemies and also keeps putting you in really hard cramped encounters. That you can't just sort of cheese your way through on the first try. Secret exit is in six. Interesting. Hey, I love this marble floor. Uh, like, I like the marble texture, and combining it with tiles is really good. This is just a stock Doom texture, like all of them are. Uh, but I feel like this isn't used enough, either in Doom stock maps or in uh, and maps. And I love these. This, this just photo of rocks or something like microscope aimed at salt crystals. I have no idea what this is. 
but it's good. So I'm glad there's just like six maps in a row that use this texture. Also, look at this sunken chunk. This is this is level design right here. Taking a screenshot of this. Maybe I'll take a better screenshot of that. There we go. Now, now I'm going to tweet it. I'm going to say this is level design right here. Config. I have a lot of screenshots. Tweet complete. The stream may resume. Alright, so as I recall, the gimmick for this map is it's actually kind of like uh, the thing from the end of map 29 of Doom 2 living end where there's three paths except it's not really like that um, because in that map only one of them was useful I think or maybe speedrunners just managed to skip them I don't know anyway this is this is non-linear in the uh, sort of true literal sense of there are three things I need to do and I can do them in any order but I do need to do them all I like this little hanging thing that stops me from just running into the lava like an idiot. That looks a lot like a thing. It's not. Oh, this is a lift. I love it. Oh yeah, yeah, this doesn't run in vanilla at all because it just vis planes. Which means, um, I think that's... It's complaining about sector planes, right? Yeah, because walls aren't planes, right? So, yeah, the the vanilla Doom renderer, uh, when it draws floors and ceilings, just sticks them all in a list. And, aha, son of a bitch. Oh, I can only see that if I was backtracking. Nice. Uh, but it sticks them all in a list, but it is a statically allocated list with not that many spaces in it and if there are too many things on the screen and by things I mean specific some kind of level geometry maybe it is walls I don't remember it's either walls or, or floors it's got to be walls because otherwise this would all be one sector okay let's say it's walls if there's too many walls on the screen at the same time uh, the list will run out of room and the game will just die like it specifically dies with an error of viz plane overflow because they just didn't even try to work around that. I think there's actually a couple places in, um, uh, is it map f f 14? The, the what's it's, um, the one made by the one guy that is the most detailed in Doom 2. Fucking hell. Uh, it's, it's the one that's like does a lot of detailed geometry, but everything is the same texture. And it's named like some kind of residential area. Uh, what the hell is it called? Help, chat. What's map 14 called? I'm pretty sure it's map 14. Why am I here? Am I getting a key? I forget what the progression is. Romero really loves cages too. They feature kind of like even just the texture all features very prominently in all these maps. Oh right, I need uh, all three keys. Well, I guess uh, I guess it's not hard to come back here and get the soul sphere if I need it. So it was interesting that the monster AI doesn't have them run directly at you. They kind of run at 45 degree angles, which is why they go kind of zigzag back and forth. 
Uh, which is actually much cooler behavior than just stuff walking straight forward. Still can't remember the name of that map. Uh, let's see. No secrets found so far. I guess let's do this one. Which, oh, sucks. Oh no. I saw that. Maybe I didn't. I thought I saw something. <laughs> Uh. Is this really an original room? Texture? Huh. Oh yeah, it's just the uh, marble with root branches thing, but without the marble. Fuck off! Imagine playing this on Nightmare. I'd have to be actually, like, good at this game. Anyway, my story about map 14 was just, I think there's one or two spots in it where you can stand that will cause a visplay overflow. <laughs> Is the encoder struggling with, with this texture? I can bump up the bitrate a little, probably. Oh, no, it's pretty high already. I could stream at 720 instead of 1080p. What is this very tall door? Oh, it's so I have to fight the Cacodemon. What a dick. This is just like slaughter map tech. I have to wait for this very dumb long thing. Oh, I'm hesitant about taking health I don't strictly need. Also, I can't believe there's no secrets in all that. It doesn't look like it. Wait a second. Wait, are there places you can run on all those platforms that will make them not fall? Hmm. I like how the switches aren't revealed until I get here. I, I assume the blue one is here. There's a bunch of dudes in there I'm gonna have to deal with. Maybe I'll get a radiation suit somewhere. Still no secrets and I'm a third done. Alright, what what is the gimmick here? Wait, inmost dens, right? That's not residential at all. I don't know why I thought that. This has a very Sandy Peterson feel to it, except they're not moving randomly. It's just for no reason carried for. I guess that's very in the spirit of Doom. Just have a room. It's boring. Do a thing to it. Oh, frick off. I'm gonna regret using rockets on really easy barons. Vulnerability. And a suspicious light. It doesn't do anything. Cool. Oh. I feel like I might need that later. But yeah, I was thinking of Inmost Dens, um, which is very brown, but has a lot of just interesting architecture, I guess. Yeah. Okay, maybe I will grab that in vulnerability. <laughs> the trick is grabbing it while the lift is up. Which it sounds like is about to happen. No! Oh, I did it. Okay.
Fuck yeah, I'm really bad at crushers. So this is probably a good call. No! 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 Uh oh. Oh, this is about to be a problem. Oh, please, please. Uh. Oh, I love this weird tech texture. Oh, this is the fucking awful crusher. symbol. Is it just a sigil? Is it the titular sigil? Yeah, don't worry. This is going to be like the next five minutes. It's just... Uh, 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 uh. Oh, this sinks so low I can't even get out of it. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Alright. Alright, I gotta say, this part... This part is not great. It's not my favorite thing to put in a video game. Oh, no. I need to fit in this hole. Please. Oh. Hey, buddy. This is terrifying. This must be how they felt in Galaxy Quest. That's my reference to Galaxy Quest, a funny Tim Allen movie. I say Tim Allen, but also had a uh, dude who plays Snake in it. Well, I guess if I don't know his name, he's not as cool. Yeah, okay, I do like the, the red flashing edging on all the spaces, and also it's pretty obvious. I love this broken teleporter. I wish it worked. Wait, why am I here? Why do I have no health? Oh, that stops them. That starts them. Okay, does this hurt me? Oh, it doesn't, thank God. Okay. Okay, oh. Well, I need to get- oh! Oh, it was a trick. Doesn't actually help. Cool. I don't think Kurt Russell played Snake. I don't know who Kurt Russell is, but I associate the name with action movies. I don't know any names of actors. I don't know anything. I can't remember the last time I saw a movie. Okay, well, the timing is such that this is impossible. Alan Rickman. That guy. Also known for that joke about Alan Rickman's answering machine, which I assume is from Family Guy. Mmm, I love pop culture from ten years ago. Which is, I guess, when I stopped Getting past what? Where am I even going? Am I going straight ahead? This sucks. Imagine trying to speedrun this. <laughs> just, just the whole game, like single segment. And this is this is just your run killer, because it literally kills you. Because it cannot be done. Okay. Uh, uh. 
Now there's some angry faces. But I did get a key. Probably like the other four secrets are in this fucking room. garbage. What? <laughs> that's that's a little anticlimactic on the on the left side there. It's weird that this just feels like the same aesthetic as the last map. Also, that's dark, but that's not. Interesting. This is about one of the best places of rockets. A reporter. Hmm, and suspicious corner. Fuck off. Well, at least they're in a group, so more bang for your butt. Uh, he must have known his secrets in this one were a bit rough, since I get a free auto map. Okay, don't touch the face. Why does he give me an auto map and then hide all the secrets? What is the point of the auto map? Anyway, we're definitely going over there. Probably dying. Oh, we're totally dying. Wait. Oh. The cracks aren't damaging. Or, oh no, it doesn't count because I'm not standing on the floor. I love the damaging floor logic. It's goofy. In, in Z-Doom, in maps that actually intend for you to be able to run, or, or jump, sorry, uh, you can be almost safe on damaging floors by just sort of bunny hopping across them because you only take damage on ticks where you're actually touching the floor okay well uh, i guess time to go back and mop up this auto map is completely useless it just is telling me i've already seen everything Oh, hang on. That looks new. I can't... You can't see me pointing at my screen, but... Oh, did these come back up? Wait. Oh. Okay, they came back up, but they stayed damaging. Awesome. Let's fucking go. Come on. Come on, please find me. Okay, this sucks. 
This could be difficult. What? Where'd you go? Oh, it kills you. Okay. All right. Well, still no secrets. Uh, boy, this one's gonna be a blast. I think I've picked up all the health except for the soul sphere I left in here. Aside from the thing I shot over here, I think. Or no, the thing I shot was Yeah, okay, it was like in there. This is weird. It seems very conspicuous, but it isn't anything. This is the one branch that seems ripe for secrets, but I don't see very many. Suspicious textures, or oh, this is right across from. I didn't do anything. This is right across from uh, that suspicious crack. There was a white line there a second ago. Diagonally. Don't know why. Boy, I have no idea. This map is just walkways over lava. Hang on. Did I just hear something? The thing I did like about Doom was uh, just walk over triggers, which are painfully arbitrary, but I don't know, it's like a tiny puzzle to figure out where you have to step to make a thing happen and pay attention to the sound effects, but, ooh. One rocket, excellent. Okay. I have no idea what opened that. I'll take it. Where else is conspicuous? I love looking at the auto map because, I mean, you can tell someone drew this. made some boxy platforms and then scribbled jaggy walls around the edges. You done here? Is there any 
is definitely. Oh, oh, can I just hear the parts of the other room? Maybe. Well, I am again open to suggestions. Last time I said that, I didn't get any. I am curious if that teleporter takes me anywhere special. Nope. I think that happened once or twice in uh, original, or, yeah, just the original levels, was there was just a lava teleporter, innocuous, except it happened to take you to a secret. That sounds like a very Doom 2 thing also. I think Gotcha does that a few times. Okay, and that leaves the right. Oh, is this the one with the fucking platforms? Pressures. I'm still befuddled by this. This... Very... Conspicuous... this were on the map. Like, why is the ceiling different here? I found this last time. Oh. Okay. That was a fake one. And this is not on the map. That's weird. And this is a door. As shown on the map, but I don't know how to open it. This still looks like something. I can't believe it's just a f um. Damn it. Okay, there's two ways to come into this room. But I used both. Is there something in the middle? I love I love what Mass Look does to the sprites. Hang on, I have an idea. But I have to wait for this very slow lift. same kind of shape as that bump over there, so it might do something. What if I shoot that? No. Oh boy! I 
don't know. What happens if I just cannot find the secrets? I did not establish stream rules in advance. Um, well, we're hitting almost half an hour on this map, and I think that might be a reasonable cutoff, or I don't know. Oh, but I have to go back. I wonder if there's any stuff in here. I wish I knew what this symbol was. Possibility of secrets in all this. That would be terrible. Oh boy. This would be a lot of fun. Just kidding. I do object to having to stand on this like two pixel ledge. Designed this and why? Oh no, that one's stuck going slow. Uh oh, please let me through. This sucks. This is the worst map in the set. I'll keep the blue. This is the worst map in the set because of this room alone. Okay, this. Oh, this one is a lift. Never mind. I like the narrow switches. Well, um. Uh, Decino on YouTube recently did a guest video of someone doing a 100% nightmare run through Sigil, so I guess we can all just go watch that after this, because I don't know. Oh, this map was cool. Alright, so far I've spent an hour on this. Half an hour of it was in the previous map. Hey, did he change the read this? Oh. I love the Zacer is in here. That's awesome. That was a fucking cyber demon. Oh yeah, that nightmare run is also a pistol start everything. It's actually a little sad that there's this like huge cool oh man this has a lot of monsters just outside border and then the map itself is really compact Getting shot. he's just in the lava chat says the crusher room is pretty polarizing which is interesting because I don't see how anyone could say it's extremely good. I'm gonna get shot. I love this simulated fire blue. Get back down here.
Well, I'm going for a hundred, but I don't know how to kill a cyber demon. Also, I remember this room um, is a bit rough on Hurt Me Plenty, and I feel like I might be about to be hurt plenty. Puzzle way to kill the cyber demon, maybe? <laughs> That's pretty good. Fuck you. Forget how to leave again. Uh, when I first played this, I got stuck in this room for approximately forever. And then someone told me to do something that seemed very obvious in retrospect. And now, I don't know what it was. It was like, just go back in one of these cubbies or step on the teleporter again or something. Uh, but those don't seem to be doing a lot. Ah. How am I going to kill him? I am not rolling in bullets or anything else. Eh. Uh, did that do any progression? Only two secrets, too. Oh, there's two of them. Even better. I do see a blue armor over in that other building. Are you here just to prevent me from looking around the backs of buildings? That's very rude. There's some guys. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, like, I like the set. Uh, obviously, I'm playing it a second time. Harder this time. It is, it is a little weird. I mean, I know he was going for like... Oh. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Uh, I know he's going... Oh, I have to go collect all this stuff again. I know he was going for like, hey, this is fucking tough and just like hostile. But, man, itsy bitsy platforms on lava are not necessarily awesome. Hang on a second. Really? Really? There's only two secrets in the level with two cyber demons. That's one of them. Four shells and a stim pack.
Man, he was just having a bad day when he made this one. Fucking Sandy. Doing Mount Erebus and then making everybody want to do outdoor levels. Well, I'm glad I have four armor to make up for the eight armor I lost when running across. Oh, fuck you. Uh, I don't remember how to get up. Well, let's run around. Uh, need a key. Not this way. Oh, Christ. How do I get up there? Okay, so I need to get up there. Oh, there's a little window. I get up there. Can I just circle around again? Oh, okay. This music is very good, though. Oh, that's why this little platform thing is here. To hide from fucking rockets. Oops. This is a fun room, as I recall. I'm going to run out of. Like, honestly, I don't know how you can run into this room and see a wall behind some bars and be like, yep, that checks out. Definitely nothing terrible will happen when I hit this button. I love the Doom shotgun. Like, from this perspective, it does not look like a shotgun. It just looks like a handgun. And in my head, that's always what my mental image of it was. Ooh! What is that? Completely out of bullets. At this point in the map, you would not yet have a rocket launcher. Also, none of that was secret. Does this hurt? Oh, thank God. This plan is not working out great. Don't worry, it's about to work out even worse. Ow. Switch me to a chainsaw. Oh my 
God, stop auto switching. I just want to punch some stuff. I hate hoof.wave. DS hoof. Okay. Very satisfying. Hmm. Alright, who thinks I can punch this cacodemon? Ow. Yeah. That was a poor use of health. Oh, teleporter came down back there. Okay. Let's just run this way real quick. What? Oh. Oh, that's what that's for. You son of a bitch. I know I saw a blue armor somewhere. So I'm pretty interested in, in getting that. Oh man. Oh man. How do I hear teleporting? Love that blue armor. Maybe let's figure that out real quick. Where the hell was it? Oh, another. Ah. Oh. Hmm. Wait, what is this? Seems to be a trail of corpses. That seems like a great idea to follow. Oh, it's a yellow door. On a corner, which is very cool. Okay, Cyber Demon's dead. Pretty happy about that. Stuff teleporting. Less happy about that. Jump across the front? No. Oh, okay, so this this was like the secret bit. I just chickened out because there was a cyber demon. Okay. Okay. I like how uh, this map, even Romero thinks it's hard enough to merit having like a whole, I don't know, three med kits. Oh, fuck. I'm really bad at not falling in lava. All right, well, let's go the slightly slower way. Oh, the door closed. That would do it. Oh, I want this health. Oh, I could get that secret stim pack. Thank you, John, for being so magnanimous. Dick. I like the, 
just roots or vines or something that are growing in this blood tower. Okay, this should be much, uh, much easier now that I don't have a cyber demon trying to pop me. secret somewhere. Oh, come on. I remember this room. I remember dying in this room several times. Can't wait to do it again. I love centered weapons. Like, okay, it doesn't give me a, a great view of like what the game thinks the gun is shaped like, whatever. But, I don't know, it looks like I'm holding it. This texture is gross. Just... Like, okay, that that's like cartoony, I get it. It's supposed to be guts, I guess, but it looks like some sort of octopus texture. Uh, but this is, this is just like the wall is injured and actual bits of it are coming out. Okay, so that's the sound of my imminent demise. Or maybe the switch that opens my imminent demise. There we go. Oops. Oh, there's, there's arguably a bug here in that I can just stand on this ledge. Wait. I guess it opens later. Where did you go? Uh, and yeah, I like that the with centered weapons, like it kind of points straight into where you will be shooting. Whereas with sort of diagonal weapons, it's like, well, I guess I'll hit something. Loves cacodemons in tight spaces. It's so weird how in this game, like the cacodemon is the only mid-tier monster. What is moving now? Something somewhere. Oh, is it that door opening? Thank God. <laughs> I 
Please tell me you can't come up here. Well, that's it. Everything's dead. Except this guy. Um, did miss a secret somewhere. I've got 10 minutes to look for it. I don't really want to. <laughs> Anything obvious on the map? Well, it suggests there's something here or there's just a light thing. What, what was that? I heard a ka-chunk. What? Okay, that's just supposed to free me from the trap that is being in here with a baron. But joke's on you, John. I didn't come in the room in the first place because there was a baron in it. Um... I don't feel like there's a ton of... big places to hide something. I love that he just drew these buildings and then just filled them with stuff. Like, here's a box, and he just made a squiggle spiral in it. Um... Is there anything out in the void? Nope. Alright. There is one place that might have... Wait a second. What? What is that? It's like a torch sticking through the wall texture. Is it just literally... Okay, yeah, it's just clipped into the wall slightly. Okay, so I think there's some space unaccounted for inside here, maybe. Oh! Uh, cool. Oh! Oh, that's very cute, actually. <laughs> I like that a lot. All right, now can I get my way back without touching the lava? <clears throat> can you better touch lava? Yes, I can. Because I'm so good at doom. I'm really not. I'm terrible at this game. All right, this is map five, right? So the next map has a secret exit somewhere. Triple Hundo. I want to make a map set where the level with the secret exit in it is called the secret exit is in this one. Back down to 75 monsters, but I bet they're worse.
What a good introduction. I already hear teleporting. What? Someone's biting my butt. A plasma cell? That's that's very good. I heard a thing open. A plasma gun for free. So far, most of the rocket launchers have been very expensive. Or at least, like, you know, in secrets or whatever. Ow, what? I wonder if I can... Um... How do I make... Really? That's that's what GL considers to be the fuzz effect. Where the fuck did you come from? Alright, hang on. I need my fuzzy specters. Which might mean I need to switch. Ooh. Damn. That's ugly. Okay. Yeah, we'll go True Color Software. Very nice. Oh, looking up and down is going to be fun. Oh, wait. You know what? I've never used the... the software poly renderer. Hmm. Give this a try, I guess. Oh! That's why I don't see anything teleport in, because it's invisible. This room is like perfectly calibrated um, to get my face bit. Fuck off. Oh Christ. It's dark. I can't see anything. Oh, <laughs> okay. Plan B. That's the n official name of this gun. Oh, that's not a light switch at all. Watching this and concerned that you can't see anything, don't worry, neither can I. How is that a secret? Is it a secret because it's fucking dark? Maybe. Oh, health. More health. Oh, well, there's a cacnea. Boy, I wish I had a super shotgun. the other one I can't see it's really dark this is the true 1993 doom experience actually I guess if we wanted the true 1993 doom experience uh, we would need the status bar that's f interesting Oh, it's very hard to see. I have never in my life quite so much appreciated that light switch in the focus as I do right now. Oh. 
Oh, this is very harrowing, actually. Is that the same one or a different one? God! This is a poor use of plasma. They're so fucking buff. How just meaty these dudes are. I love, I love that he specifically made these bars very close together so you can't glide through them. Okay, but then he made, so you have to, wait, did that do something else? It's not hard. It's. What? What is... What? Well, hang on. That's definitely a thing. What is that? Whoa. Don't switch me at that. No, I want to go back up. Oh, this game's giving me a lot of plasma. For the love of Christ. <laughs> Found out what the plasma is for. Software transparent. I love it. I don't like the billboarding though. That looks like garbage. Uh. What? How do I turn that off? Is that more or less billboarding? Um, hmm. Figure that out in a minute. Okay, that doesn't affect it. So it's just baked into the poly render, I guess? Okay. Well, that's weird. Um, I do like this little marker for this is the end of this series of things. Also, it really looks like that should be steps you can go up. Um.
Uh. Oh. Oh, that's unnerving, actually. I can't, not only can I not go the other way, it's like I could never go the other way. God damn it. Oh, is this what all the plasma was for? Because there's a fucking cyber demon? And now I used it on nonsense. Where is it? Is there just a cyber demon somewhere in this maze? Wait, there's like a weird teleport trap in this maze. Oh, fuck off. I tried to strafe out of the way and I got caught on geometry. Which is annoying because like you could just make like this lip unblockable and then I could not actually get into this gap and it wouldn't be a problem. Oh man, multiple berserks. Didn't actually mean to pick that up, but that's fine. Oh, Jesus. All right, let's pick off some of these rampart dudes. Are these ramparts? I don't know, I'm not really up to date on correct names for parts of a castle. Hey, I wonder if I could get, uh, the Baron to fight Cyber Demon? Does that seem... Does that seem plausible? Feasible? You know, I never thought I would say this in my whole life, but I would kill for some light amp goggles. Eh, fuck it. Mm. Oh hey, thanks for the bits. Which I think are just scents, but renamed. Right? Is that the exchange rate? Like one to one? Or is it like DeviantArt points where it's like each one is 1.25? 1 Off just enough so you can't actually tell what anything's worth. Okay, so you can reach me from here. don't know which parts of the maze are accessible to the Cyber Demon, which is how it's spelled in the UK. For example, can he shoot me if I'm up here? Don't know. Wait, what? 
what am I doing? Oh my god. Oh, I'm running away. No, I'm getting caught on geometry. It's nice to be like basically full on shells. Also, hang on, there's like a bug on my desk? No? Huh, I thought I felt something. I like this uh, panel here. Stop me from fucking up the jump. Oh, ow. Not what I wanted. some rockets. When did that happen? Okay. Little guy down. This seems like a good place for a bunch of secrets. Just like in the first map. Because this is kind of the same background style. Let's see here. I love that this room is actually very simple, but from the ground, it's really fucking complicated. What? I don't remember that from Hurt Me Plenty. Yoink. found the bug. It's an ant. How dare you. I don't have anything to get it. Get off of me. Hang on. I need to kill this ant before it reports the location of our kitchen back to the hive. The intruder has been neutralized. Oh, I lost a bunch of that health I just got already. I, I do like uh, maps where the entrance is right next to the exit. Okay, uh, question. How the fuck do I get back to the first part of the game? Also, now I just f feel Phantom Ant on me all the time. Awesome. Okay, I need to kill you still, and there's another one of you fuckers. Don't move. All right, how many cells does it keep take to kill a cyber demon? I can never remember this. 
Seems like the sort of thing I should know. But it's not. Oh. Okay, I hate these walls a lot. This is not gonna end well. <sighs> now, strictly speaking, I don't need to kill this cyber demon. But I am going to. One way or another. I don't know what the other way would be here. I guess MDK. Or I could just shoot the wall a lot, that'd be good. Uh oh. Hmm. Oh man, I'm not great at Cyber Demons at the best of times. And this is not the best. Also, Baby is uh, in front of my screen a little bit. Hi, Baby. Everyone say hi, Baby. Well, nobody said it, but it's okay, Baby. Oh, fuck off, dude. Okay. Well, my plan was... Let's... Let's fight in this cool little arena in the middle. But then, uh... You had that idea first. Where are you? Okay. all these little corners. They are quite bad. Also, I hate fighting cyber demons. Because you have to dodge their shots by about half a mile. And if you don't, you just die. Or wish you were dead. And they have so much health. Uh, I did only say 100% secrets. And I mean, oh come on. I mean, I found him, which kind of counts. Okay, is there anything up here? I feel like there should be. Like this really looks like there should be some stuff. Um, there isn't. Really? There's got to be a... I was going to say, there's got to be a spot where I can cheese him, but that does not seem to be the case. Unless... I can't think of one place. Secrets here. There's secrets somewhere. Well, this might actually work. I was gonna do the center, but yeah, buddy. 
Okay. This does not work like E2M8. Frick. This sucks. I'm out. Um, I don't know where more secrets are, and also part of the map is now permanently blocked off. So I, I guess I can't go secret hunting either. Wait, wait, this is the one with the secret exit. Uh, uh oh. Um, I haven't even seen the secret map, and I would kind of like to. How the hell do we get back in here? What is that stray white line way over there? Oh! That's a shootable wall with a channel headed straight for it. Hang on, maybe we can... Maybe we can still rescue this fucking map. Oh Christ. Please stop shooting me. Which way is it? Yeah, baby. What did that do? Didn't open that back up. The only way out of that box was this teleporter, which took me back here. Oh, fuck me. Oh, this is about to get very unpleasant. Um, very much need to figure out what that switch did very quickly. That's cool. What did you get in here? No choice. That's a regular exit. Ooh. 
wish you would go away. Now's the time for safe scumming. I hate cyber demons. I hate that I can say cyber demons, plural. that I can't move out of the fucking way. You're gonna get caught in the wall. Doom is not great at like sliding you along curved surfaces. Uh, I don't know, they're just not fun. They just have so much health. And rockets do so much damage. And in close quarters? Like, come on. Okay, well, I think we can do that a little better, but it's good to know how much this is going to take. All of it. Oh, he left. Oh, even better. Okay. Holy moly, there, if nothing else, we got 100% kills. All of us together. Just kidding, uh, I'm not sure anyone's watching. Okay, so now do I go to that spot where I can jump off, maybe? Because that was objectively a very cool spot to shoot. And this is very conspicuous. And I very... Oh, there's even... Wait, those two torches are for the entrance. Never mind. I thought I was using different color torches to mark where to shoot. But it was just to mark where I came in. This is still nothing. Well, what the hell? I can even hear a thing opening. Did it open something inside the cage and I didn't notice because I was busy running away? Something back here, maybe? Oh, oh, hell yeah, we found it! 
glorious. Glorious, unrotated floor texture because it's vanilla. Let's fucking go! Now, let's see. Secret maps are always gimmicky in some way, so I wonder what this one's about. See some boxes. This boy really likes cages. What on earth? Just a little piston thing? Interesting. This music is cool. I've also discovered from, uh, I guess, a combination of this map and watching some Plutonia runs recently, uh, that I really like platforms. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, I like this. Not really threatening, but still sets the tone. Uh, but I really like platforms over shallow lava. Doom usually has them, uh, you know, like a, a mile up, so if you fall, you're basically in a completely different place. Uh, but these are just kind of like, yeah, well, it's just like a walkway, just right there. So if you fall off, just step back on. And that's kind of cool. What? Ah, oh, crap. How did that hurt? I was not standing in the lava. that. When did this open? Did it open just because I went around and saw the thing? What? Oh. Oh, is it just if you turn left you'll see it, if you turn right you won't? That's kind of funny. Look at that billboard. In. Beautiful. That like tilts too, that's weird. Okay, don't have any keys yet. I wish there had been some intermission text for explaining what I have found here. big box with very complicated ceiling and a key in the corner. That's a very sandy thing, just key in the corner, like it's nothing. Hmm. I like this faux machinery. Don't like that. Oh. Need to not run under the tiny pressures.
Well, it's not really shaped like this, but it looked like it was at first. I was just reminded of how, uh, uh, what was it, like E1M3 maybe? Had that, like, swastika room that just had walls shaped like a swastika and it was intended as a Wolfenstein reference, but people did not take it as a Wolfenstein reference. And so on, in like Doom 1.2, they patched it out and now it's just an abstract shape. Then in Doom 2, they just put a level from Wolfenstein, and that was fine. Also, I like how um, to keep the lava bright, but but the edge of this platform dark, there's a teeny tiny dark sliver of lava, because walls just inherit the lightness from the sector that they're part of. So you basically have to do that. This map is really weird. It's got a lot of just square rooms. And it's not especially difficult either. And it has these weird little crusher things. Um, okay. Hey, I like lifts with things on them. Decorative lifts. You know what I like more, though, is secrets. Like that one. Aha! Can't fool me, John. Fuck. I guess you can. Well, that would have been very clever. I'm sure it's something. Oh. Okay, it is. It's just not a secret. <laughs> I do like having to like make my way over the edge of that, that room. This is cool. I wonder if I'm gonna get a BFG here? Like, uh, secret levels tend to load you up, and I don't remember if there's actually a BFG anywhere in the rest of the maps. I like these chunky stairs. Now this reminds me a little of Living End. don't have a blue key though. Uh, are you gonna make me run through the lava? John? Okay. Well now we can look for something. Never mind, there's nothing to be found. Wait, there's a teeny tiny crack that looks like it has a... Oh, that would be cheating. Well, what am I supposed to do? I haven't seen a blue key yet. The one near the beginning was a... Uh, yellow key. Also, for some reason, this entire castle is marked as not on map. I keep hearing a thing go ka-chunk. Oh, crap. Um... Okay. Oh, did I get the radiation suit so I'd come in here? That would be kind of clever. 
Let's try that out. Oh, this log only does three damage. What a surprise. A bunch of dudes. A bunch of dudes. And, aww. Oh. Um. I don't have a ton of good ammo. Come on. Yeah! Go, Cacti. Took two of you, but you did it. Okay, we'll keep. Uh, there's anything. I have this tiny lip so I can get back up. Take a while. This fucking suit is gonna run out by the time I get back there. Aww. Well, I guess I don't really need it just to hop across the blue door. Wasn't map 10 by Romero, the pit? Or was that a sandy map? I like how sandy is just an adjective used for maps. Now. Oh, what? Well, that escalated quickly. What am I supposed to do with you? Okay, there is technically a rocket launcher in this room. This sucks. Is there anything up here that can help me? Oh my god. I have to go all the way around to hit that button. Oh yeah, sorry. Uh, Ten is uh, refueling base. Oh. Okay. What is the point of this ledge? To make me fall in the lava. Oh uh, yeah, refueling base is the one of my nightmares. It just creeped me out as a kid for some reason. I think just because. I thought my dad was like super great at Doom, but he kept dying on refueling base. Ah, And so the idea that, to, to me as like a, I don't know, nine, ten year old, like something could defeat my dad is terrifying. Don't know what that did. Ah, okay. 
Uh, so far, so good. I do not have enough stuff to kill this man. Oh, fucking... Cyberdemon just to get here, and now my reward is another one. Oh my god. And you give me ten rockets to kill it. Cyberdemon takes at least twenty, right? I really want to know what that shooting button did. Also, I really wish this switch had another switch on the back. Because that's my favorite thing. Anyway. What the hell was the point of that? Oh. Let's get up here. Uh, This is stupid, right? This is going to take like 60 shots. And I think his gun is bigger. Oh my god. Nope, deciding by fiat. Cyber demons do not count against the kill count. Shooty? Wait, how did that pillar get there? I thought it was... I don't understand why it brought me here. Yeah, but the, I mean, the yellow key is still blocked off. Ooh. Oh, beautiful. I guess this renderer is not quite perfect yet. I thought that was E fighting at first, but no, there's a decent gap between those. Whatever, that's more renders than I've written. Uh, so I need like a teleporter to get in there. is lying very cutely on Ash's deck. He doesn't do that very often. He usually just wants to fight. <laughs> He's so cute. Um, I don't get this map. I felt like it was gonna be, you know, I don't know, something. Um, but it's just sort of another map. Which, I mean, is fine, but I don't know, all the Doom 1 uh, super levels had like a gimmick. Well, I guess military base didn't. 
So I guess John Romero just doesn't know how to make secret maps <laughs> or something. Bunch of secrets that I haven't found. And I don't know what we're gonna do with the cyber demon. And I don't understand how to get the yellow key. So progress thus far could be better. And I don't know what that one shooting button is. Well, now this is very much like The Living End, which ended with a fucking cyber demon. Except that one was optional. At least he's stuck in there. This standing with my back to a wall is not the best idea. I can't believe I'm killing a fucking cyber demon with a regular shotgun. I can't believe it's kind of working. Kind of. Where's my mega sphere? These shells that I've saved up over the past like four maps. I was just going into this idiot. People like fight these things and dodge the rockets by like one pixel. Wish this fucking tree wasn't here. At least there's still an observe. Okay, there we go. Now we can look around to our heart's content. So what the hell did that open? I don't see any like doors. Oh, I found one. Oh. Oh, what? It's the GZ Doom uh, light amp effect in software, except without the thing with the sprites, which is actually better. So, I don't really understand what that walkway is for. Also, green does conflict a little bit with. Uh, color of radiation suit. There's clearly a thing back there. I call this stuff not a map. I don't understand. I don't understand what this like ledge is for either. Oh, I guess I could have just stepped on this without going around, huh?
that dude's shotgun get crushed? Um... I don't know, I did this every day when I came out. Put me on, on this ledge. And that just leads nowhere. I'm starting to feel like I cannot entirely trust this renderer though. <laughs> I love, like I was so used to software stretch perspective for so long and then I tried GZ Doom for the first time and I was like, what the fuck is this? Um, oh no. Beautiful. I guess that's what I turn get what I get for turning on XY billboarding. Um I don't understand the progression here. I need to be able to get back there. Um but the fucking map is broken. There's large chunks of it, not visible. There's still a decent chunk of monsters left somewhere. Let's lower the lift. The button on the other side opened that door. I guess I could take this one armor bonus. Yeah, it has to be gated behind the blue key. This is the blue key door room thing. I, I do really enjoy um, when a door takes you into a place that is exposed to places you could get to before. Like, you couldn't see into this room before, so it's a little different, but, like, um, just, just the idea that this just opened up sort of part of an existing accessible room instead of taking it to a new room is always cool to me. What? Okay, well, that still doesn't help. Okay, I heard someone go ka-chunk. There's so many, it's just little triggers in this fucking map set. Ah. Now, I am in a cage, so this might do something terrible. Oh my god, this is- okay, I like these lava steps. This is a better end with something really mind-blowing amazing. Did I get a berserk? I did. I'm going on a punching rampage. Whoops. Step down trick. Okay. 
Yeah, that was like a really simple, easy room. <laughs> nice. Right after a fucking cyber demon. Okay, well I guess that's a little more like it. But still, this is like more space to work in than anything else in this game so far. a secret somewhere but and I really want to know where it was because I feel like I should have earned ammo or something uh, um, oh that's a weird transition I do like that uh, floor textures just automatically align and do since they're all aligned to the grid anyway, whether you like it or not. As long as if I step on this. Nothing. I feel like the secret level was just a punishment. I had to defeat a cyber demon just to get to it, and then my reward was I had to defeat another cyber demon. You know what? Fuck it. Wait, this doesn't help because IDT doesn't show me. What is all that? Hang on. Oh wait, oh that's probably where the monsters came from, okay. Wait, but there's like, there's like architecture over there. Is there, is there a cheat code for like, uh, there is. Wait, no, that just shows pretty floors. I need cheat code for show me the auto map, but also ignore uh, lines that are. Oh, there's a plasma gun. Okay, that's the monster component. Oh, right, each of these maps has a separate deathmatch area. Okay, so that's not interesting for our purposes. So I guess the only other secret is that plasma gun, which, to be fair, I wouldn't mind having. Let's, let's uh, take a shot at that. Huh. Probably could have figured that out since I did on the other side. But... Okay, well that's the whole map then. Let me turn off map cheat. <laughs> okay, well, on to map seven. Hi, Annis. Annis, come here. Come purr over here with me. Oh good, 178 monsters. Just as many as I was hoping for. Oh, is this the weird one? Oh, we're getting some shells. There's a lot of parts of these maps that are just kind of... Oh, okay, that was deliberate. Never mind. What? 
Okay. Well, I was about to rag on that for being a bug. It wasn't one. Oh yeah, this is one with all the spines everywhere, which is a really cool aesthetic, actually. You know what else I like as a Doom gimmick is teleporters that go somewhere else if you take them from the back. I think that happens like twice in Doom 2 and that's it. Oh, good. Oh. Also, teleporting that uh, works better if you turn around and you do it. Ennis, don't knock my plate off my desk. It's very rude. Yeah, this is the... I guess this walkway is like the most linear and yet also not part of the whole set. And if you haven't seen the set before, well, you'll find out in about an hour when we get to it. But first, I have to jump into fucking lava. What? Ow. Oh my god. Yes, I'm gonna kick your butt. Hey, remember when I had armor? That was pretty good. Remember when I had health? That was pretty good. Didn't I have a lot of it? I'm actually running out of shells. I used them all in a second. I love that nonsense. Annis. Annis, do you need feeding? Oh, but I'm very busy playing John Romero's Sigil TM. This is the Doom experience, just running through a hallway, shooting one dude at a time. secret hunting right here and I found a couple things and this was one of them Ooh, I like that thanks they're they're hard to design for because uh, of course once you have them you have them forever now, is there a double secret here? Aha! I also like lifts that actually do something other than what it seems like they do. Doing pretty good on secrets. And most of the enemy is a little wise, which is nice. Is that a BFG? Oh, hell yeah. Out of bullets. Less good. Uh, 
Good news, I'm about to get 10. have that. Okay, I guess we'll do some stuff. I remember something scary in the uh, near future. Possibly when I pick up this red key. Fucking hell. Oh, oh. Take me. Let's try that with less getting shot in the face. Okay, well, I got some armor, so that's good. Boy, I hope there's a berserk pack real soon. But let's make a style save and hope for the best. Where is that shotgun guy? Kept shooting me when I was over here. Oh, it's here. Nope, still don't see him. I cannot survive that. <laughs> uh, but let's try anyway. Oh, oh, this is twenty damage lava. Oh, I'm in trouble. Well, it's cool. We're already halfway through the level. Twelve health. Doing great. Battle of Century. Whoa! Jesus Christ, did not expect you to be right on my ass. Well, okay, we came out of that not too bad. What did that accomplish? I did hear a door open. Ah. Oh. 
Time for rockets. Uh oh, maybe not. Really dense noise, you mean high entropy texture? Although it's not just about entropy, because like fire blue, I think it's both entropy and the fact that the uh, uh, the colors are not what like H two six four is designed for, which is more flesh tones and stuff, and also I guess specific kinds of gradient that occur in the real world. shells because I don't have a lot again okay well Cacodemon's gonna come out probably oh Cacodemon came out I got a lot of rockets actually I can't believe they let you have a hundred rockets in this fucking game because that is more bang for your buck than Basically any other weapon. Even plasma, I'm not sure, is worth as much as 100 rockets. Now what? Ah. Uh. off. Well, like I said, I got a lot of rockets. <sighs> yeah. Come on, Kakra, you can do it. Come on, I'm helping you so much. It's a tie! I win. Dad. Oh, wait, I don't have 10 health anymore. Very good. Just heard more things go ka -chunk. This is a cool room. As cool rooms go. What the fuck is opening? I mean, I know he's he's using that to do like little set pieces and sort of faux scripting and stuff, but uh, that is the sort of sound that usually indicates, hey, there's a secret thing somewhere. And these maps it doesn't. And making this episode 5 of Doom and then kind of breaking that convention is a bit of a shame. I want all those shotguns. Alright, here comes here comes the fun part. Because each of these little guard houses. Um, has a teleporter pad at the edge. It takes you back somewhere. You've already been, and now with the teleporter, it turns you to the sequence. And it's a really... Oh. Okay. Cool. Uh, it's a really interesting idea. Annis, you gotta hang on. This is this is a very dramatic moment. Now, please do not insert your claws into my body. Or my clothes. Again, I don't know what else I'm going to use it for. Ah. Yeah, I know. Are they 
like dudes in there. Oh, it's just the same. Okay. Well, let's waste some rockets. Section three. Oh, this one's new. God, imagine playing this on co-op. How much would it get fucked up? Oh wait, are there even co-op starts? Yes. <sighs> Remember this bit. Oh, this is fucking cool. Oh. Makes sense. I love this coffin. Like, especially with this edging, it works really well. Oh. Ah, my favorite map, The Chasm by John Romero. in a while. The cacodemon alert sound is kind of like cheese ball hissing. Okay. See here. Yes. You can wait like a minute. It's going to be more than a minute. you. Oops. It's cool. Okay, I guess I'll feed Anis while you stare at this dead demon. Please give me 30 seconds. Come on, Anis.
All right, hello. I'll just edit this uh, brief intermission out in post. Let's see. I love how I can see your smarmy fucking grin from a mile away. Oh. Oh, I used like all my rockets up, huh? Every time I think I have ammo, this fucking set denies me. Whoa! Oh crap. Oh no. <sighs> Honestly, that would have been a good time for plasma, huh? Can I, like, shove myself in any of these for any material gain? Eh. Oh, fuck. Uh. I was correct. This is much better. Oh, we're almost at the end. Of the map, I mean. Not of this trench. Oh. Oh, I know this room. I guess this is basically the end of the set, so... It's going to be the most obnoxious thing that my buddy John has to offer. You know what? Since we are almost... Oh, come on. Please come over here so I can rocket you. Please. Oh, you're not gonna, are you? Great. It's cool. Alright, um, also this is the bit that that one review video was complaining about, and to be fair, yeah. Oh, I thought I was gonna fall in the stuff. Uh, and that's almost everyone dead. Interesting. Still don't think I can reach this fucking armor. Is there any health left in this level? Not, not seeming like it. Uh, oh, come on. Great. Anything? Yeah, that gave me rockets. Could, I would love a berserk. Do hear a grumble. Okay, well I can't backtrack any further.
Who's grumbling? Nope. So the map is just permanently altered. Or oh, I wonder what happens if I jump down and then try to go to those places again. Wait, where's that little tiny maze? Uh... Oh, okay, it is there. Because I... Th Unbelievable. All right, well, fuck it. We got 100% of nothing. Okay, see, they put a dead Doom guy here to warn you. This room is dangerous. And then he didn't have quite enough room for the entire wall texture, so... Well, um, not quite 100% secrets. I'm pretty sure that green armor was one, but I cannot survive the journey. And half of the map is fucked up now so who even knows if I can go back to it fuck it all right doing this two and a half hours oh uh, this one's weird and gross too that's like that's like the fat layer under the skin or something what oh Okay, you idiots can't get me. Making me earn these keys. Thank God. This is good music. This is just slightly sort of obnoxious 90s MIDI. But just a little bit. Uh, are you gonna... Guess not. Oh, what? I saw a fireball. It's serious time. Maybe. I guess I don't need a ton of ammo from this point on. Oh, I have no rockets. I don't remember quite that much dudes on Hurt and Plenty. Oh, I bet I can... I bet I can glide this. Maybe? I guess not. Uh... What am I doing now? That... oh. Okay, what could possibly go wrong? Oh, a lot. Where 
there's anger man. Hey, what's up, nerds? Whoops. Thank you. Hmm. That sounds like a thing I want. How do I get back up there? Take the cells. Eh. Three to go, and we're done with the game. It's so weird to put this little, like, mini downtown style of thing right at the end. Still two secrets. Hey, what's up? Actually, what am I doing? Let's do it the pro way. Oh, uh, whoops. It's fine. We're fine. Now the final boss. Really? I can't even pick it up? Okay. Don't know what I missed. Uh, and that's Sigil. Most of it. I like how just short and sweet this is. All right, cool. Now there is one thing I wanna do, which is, um, remember how to do deathmatch. Not like that. Uh, hang on, let me uh, let me look this up. Okay, I was close. Uh, let's dash host one. And then plus map E5 M1. Nope. 
What? Uh, let's try warp. Uh, oh wait, oh, I have to do death dash match, death, the dash death match, or it's co-op by default. So now we can see the co death match maps. Interesting. So, I wonder what those do. They only open if one player on either side hits the button at the same time, I guess? Oh, I can't no clip. This is a multiplayer game. Can I next map? Okay. This is like a cute hack to just have a completely separate map um, and just put the deathmatch starts in it. Oh. Oh, this is the fire blue room to confuse your enemies. Let me just stare at this wall for a bit. Oh yeah. Oh, I love it. Oh, the best texture in this game. Mmm, what if I move around a lot? Beautiful. Okay. Let's never look at that again. This is very just Mount Erebus. Look at this. It's gorgeous. Just several buildings and can't go up there. Ah. I have received a message from Annis to Ash. It says meow. Alright, message received. Let me write down a response. Don't care. Busy playing Doom. All right, mail that back. Oh. Holy crap, it lowers the entire thing. Oh, that's ridiculous. Is this it? Oh man, the whole thing is just like these three rings, except they all go up down. Oh, but you have to jump down in the lava to get them. Okay, now how do you get that? Crap. I bet it's this switch. That should be a switch on the back. Hang on, I heard a second thing happen. I love the item respawn noise also. I didn't hear a thing happen. Okay. It would be kind of fun to actually try deathmatching on these. See how they hold up. This is just shaped like the secret from map one. Oh, this is a long straight hallway. Oh man, you know what I like is using the metal texture along with like edging on like the same edge of a lift or even just lift edges that aren't a single texture. Oh, baby! If baby's in the food box for too long, which is like two minutes, uh, he just makes the most mournful, sad meows. Uh, okay. Oh, and here's just a room with some walls. Perfect. 
Oh, I thought that would lower them. Wow, I don't know what that does. Oh, a dead end with the BFG, very nice. Oh yeah, I guess, I guess this gives you a straight shot to anyone trying to get the rocket launcher. This is, uh, well, this is kind of cool. Very easy to fall down, but there's a lot of stuff to do when you're down here. Using some textures that were not anywhere in the game proper. Don't know how to get back up. Okay. Oh, I'm guessing if you get all the way up, that's like where the BFG is or something. Oh. And that gets you a berserk. And a chain. Oh, there's a BFG. How the hell do you get that? Oh, you have to come all the way up here and then survive going all the way around? No. What? Huh. I don't know how you get it. Interesting. And there's a blur sphere. And there's this ominous. That's how you get the chainsaw. Oh, okay, and the BFG. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Oh. Oh my god, this is just the... Well, okay, it's not exactly, but it is very heavily based on just that little cyberdemon maze. Oh, that's really funny. Huh. This one's pretty simple, but it seems like it could be pretty interesting to play through, actually. Not play through, you know, like fight on. Still got this fucking easy to get caught on edging though. Which is a bit of a shame. Oh, right, actually. If you made these impassable, then you couldn't jump off the top. But you could fill this in with a self referencing sector, and that would fix it, maybe? Let's see, this one's very flat. This is just dead simple, my dude. Okay, I am kind of a sucker for the inexplicably intricate ceiling that casts a shadow. What the fuck is this? John. Oh, no. Do these even fucking lower? Yeah. I can't believe it. This is just dead simple. This is just dead simple. <laughs> it's even M7. That's incredible. Okay. I do like holes in the ceiling also. I guess uh, I guess Romero did a lot of that in E1. Mm. Uh oh. I don't entirely understand. Wait. Oh, does pressing that button no, this is new. Press the button, raise this. Oh my god, only one person can get the rocket launcher at a time? That's hilarious. Oh, 
Oh, and it's dark up here, so I can't see you. This one's this one's pretty cool. Does this do a thing? <laughs> this one's almost like a single player map. It's just stuff. Huh. I like these big old chunky stairs with this stair texture that I never really use. That one's called like stair top. It's the only one that's that tall. Um, no next map, but there is an E5 M9. The secret deathmatch map. For a second, I thought the entire map was going to be damaging floors. There's a lot of these little dual window things, and I don't know what's behind them because I can't cheat. Okay, yeah, this is the thing we saw on the map that had just these hallways. This actually kind of reminds me of a military base. E1M9. Okay. Um, and that is Sigil. Thanks for hanging out, but I ran out of game to play, so now I have to stop. And also, I have to deal with this letter from Annis. So I'll see y'all later.